he might be a senator next. Uh, he, you know, I, I think he's done being a prosecutor. Nobody likes him anymore. Be a man. It's gonna be something, something bigger. Yeah, man. Listen, man. Maybe now he'll make enough. He'll make enough money to pay his rent. Caesar, you see those T-shirts, Caesar? Though, come on, Caesar. Keep it real, man. Trap land all day, my nigga. Like, did you see the work, my nigga? You could watch my shit a hundred times, my nigga. That shit. Let him know, see. We're the true trappers, man. Hi, right, bro. You my brother. And I love you. The hoodies, yeah, but them t-shirts you wash them once and you're wearing them again. Bro, those fucking t they get Rico handcuffs, nigga. You don't know what the Rico is, nigga. This ain't no drug deal, you stupid fuck. Yeah, <laughs> like, I, I, don't I, understand, I, man. I, I, These dumb niggas on Instagram don't understand what's Rico. I, I'm, I'm not anybody. That's a uh, that's a, something that he made up with these Rico. I, you know, like, it, it, it's just, it's a fucking joke. It's a, it's a joke that, that there is no organized crime. You guys, you know, and you, you, you have let this uh, retard uh, make you believe something, make it bigger than what it is that you, you, you guys are going to see the outcome of this. You, everybody will see the Please outcome. don't talk, man. We don't talk about this. Federico, you see the work. It's okay. Let him, let him talk shit. At the end of the day, you nah. see the pot of the coal like the rainbow. You ever seen the rainbow? You ever seen the fucking rainbow when the shit don't shine no more, putos? But even Montoya. the real niggas, man. No. We the peanuts, bro. We don't fold, man. We don't give a fuck. Montoya Brader, nobody's fucking me in jail. Nobody's no. fucking Montoya, but if we're going to fuck you in jail, puto. If you want to come, I'll let you wash my boxers, though. It's okay, Montana. People talk all that shit, my nigga. But real niggas will show up right now. Kidnap you, all this shit, man. Shut the fuck up, man. Shut the fuck up. Y'all being fooled by a nigga named Tony Baloney, man. Y'all talk all that shit. It's okay, though. Right? It's okay. It is. We're going to write the book, right, Caesar? How much for our autograph, Caesar? Three. Hmm? Three autographs. Listen, you, you see the work we're going to do all next week? We're going to Brazil. I got the work tour, Caesar, coming, right? I'm working on the work tour, right? You see the work, DR. You see the work, Cartagena. You see the work, Brazil. And all these putas are going to be the Airbnb with me. I'm going to be their fucking tour guy. Hey, you want to see the work? I'm going to show y'all putos. We're going to come hard right now. We're going to go harder than ever. We're going to go hard for y'all, nigga. Nigga, say, Lucci Angel. Nigga, I don't do nothing wrong. Tell them, Cs, what I do. I work all day, right? Do I have anything to do with this bullshit? Let them know, Cs. Come on. I'm your brother. You have nothing to do with this, Louis. That's it. That's it, man. Let them know. But it's all right. But guess what? I do have something to do with it. Why? Because you're my brother, right? I will never give up on you. My brother is the best brother. The best brother. He gave me my first hooker when I was 13. Hut's point. Let him know, see, it's Hut's point, puto. Hut's point. Hut's point. Hut's point. Hut's point. That's the point, HBO. Hey, HBO, you, nigga. We were the first nigga with the hookers on the point, bro. You, you, you Y'all don't know about that shit, man. I'm going to rock with my brother. No matter what, he's my brother. <laughs> what am I going to do? Huh? Yeah. What am I going to do, puto? He's my brother. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. And mano power. You heard? We ain't no little choppers. We the piñas. You see the work. It's all right. All oh, y'all niggas gonna laugh later. Because y'all be believing a guy named Tony Baloney. Tony Baloney, man. Yeah. We're for the government, man. What this whole thing is, right? How I don't know what world we live in when people think it's okay to attack kids. I don't understand that. In the last couple months, you know, people have attacked my daughter, um, my niece nieces and nephew tony keeps on posting like bro that shit ain't cool man like what what kind of men go after kids kids and wives right like i, I don't know what kind of society you know we we live i'm in. gonna go to jail but, puto. But, hold on see they keep saying but, i'm gonna jail Let, cool. that, you know. this, 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 that shit is just crazy bro like i don't understand what kind of men how people are built anymore man like it, it, it's just disgusting you know like and uh, I, I don't know man that, that, that's the one thing that bothers me the most I don't think any man should me mention somebody else's wife or kids, right? And everybody's getting pushed to this point now where it's like there's no rules. There, there's no boundaries. Like, Tony the Closer is now selling something on his page talking about my daughter that is not true. And people... Oh, no, he puts up with big business. My nigga, like, we don't know that nigga, man. Like, I get the fuck off Tony Baloney. Will you, he, you know what it is, he said? He's a cloud chaser, bro. Now, nigga, with your friends, you see, you see the zapaticos he had on with you when he met you in Southeast? Yeah, man, that guy looked like he just fucking walked barefooted from fucking yeah, California. Yeah, my nigga, he, he already had a plan, but it's okay, Tony, man. We'll give it up to you, puto. Oh. 
I got the work. I got Caesar. Could we do a seminar together? Could you please tell DJ and for you to bring me on the Breakfast Club? No, Tony. Nobody likes you. I think I pay fifty bands to be up on the platform. You pay fifty bands, man, so so your name can ring bells. Of course, you give me fifty bands, nigga. I'm gonna fucking sell my culito. Quick, bro. They could never do what we did. They could never fill a room like we do, like we did, and you know that that made us a target, and we let people come close to us that we shouldn't have. And you know, I made a lot of mistakes too around the way. Nobody, you know. At the end of the day, my nigga, we got no friends, man. The real niggas who are behind us, we we could give it three percent. But all y'all fake ass friends, I took y'all to DR. I bought y'all hookers, my nigga. Like, Kippy G, man. I treat y'all with love. And y'all bitch ass niggas. Y'all bitch ass niggas. You know who the fuck I'm talking about. Y'all bitch. But it's okay. We don't want to talk about that right now. But at the end of the day, the light is going to come out. Because y'all make money. Uh, Pete, Caesar, why they don't talk about all the millionaires you made? Why they don't talk about that? Nobody talks about that. They're going to see that in court, though. How, right? The, 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 how, how many millionaires we got, Caesar? We have a booklet. This big of how many people have made have been successful because of us since 2017. Now, they don't see talk, that. Talk about that. They talk about they're gonna stick it to your booty hole. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yesterday I had a guy that texted me and was talking shit to me, and I was like, bro, when all this shit happened, why you ain't come out saying how you made $300,000? Oh, no, that doesn't matter. What you mean that doesn't matter? That's the whole point. You profited from my success. All these people that profited from my success, none of them are around. Nobody, and, nobody talks. Nobody bro, talks, man. It, it's okay. God only puts. Puts you through things in life that you could take, and I could take it. Or no more. I don't know. The penis story is gonna be bigger than all y'all putos. You heard that, nigga? I'm not hiding. I'm still, I'm still out here working. I'm still gonna be successful. And the come up part two is gonna be bigger than part one. I'm, yeah, but you know what? Keep I'm, listening to Tony Baloney, because he's I'm, the people's I'm, champ. I'm Tony Stark. I'm gonna do. Tony a, has to flip the property since high school, man. All these people. Tony the closer. What the fuck he closed on? See? Because I'm a hustler, and that's it. Caesar, what did Tony close on? <laughs> what Look, the only, fuck, Tony? Tony know how to close on is uh, badges when people buy. No, badges. no, no. Tony knows how to close on the girls. He give them a black eye real quick. You cheat on Tony, he gonna punch you in your face. And Ooh. he talks about women really bad. He's an abuser. Oh, you understand? Help, man. I, you know, I feel bad for him, bro. I wish somebody would get him the help he needs. You know, he doesn't know how to talk to women. Even the, that that girl, uh, Caesar, Jenny, Christina, whatever you want to call it, like he blocked her, bro. Like, bro, she giving you information. You should, yo, Caesar. If Christina was me, I would have gave you that seven forty credit score she was looking for, right? She wanted yeah. a seven twenty. Her apartment for one month. She did all the work for you, like, bro. Just pay her rent one month. Bro, like, I would have gave Christina <laughs> all the money in the world, bro. Yeah, if you're a millionaire, just pay the pay the woman's rent. You're a real, real nigga, right? Real nigga to care the bills, you know. <laughs> Like, bro, come on, man. Just pay her rent, bro. Like, be a nice guy, though. Don't be like that. That's what they call you, Tony Baloney. You're a woman beater. You have more cases than... I don't know why the feds don't like you, but it's okay. Keep, they keep have, it in your little lies. There's with, uh, with him on them to say, no means no. Yeah, or uh, real, stranger, stranger danger. Stranger danger. My nigga, like, I think it's the biggest abuser. That nigga got like 30 cases. He took about us. And then he said, we rats. You got a 5K emotion. Nigga, you wrote that shit. Nigga, who the fuck rat? See, you go live right now. Tell him who you it on, see? Anybody that sees the Pina Uberto, because they said your middle name, or Luis Manuel Pina it on, come on this live right now. Nigga, ain't nobody right on. Nobody, nigga. We real niggas. We stand up guys, bro. We real shop landlords. But you see the work. Pay your rent. See, they're late, right? Yeah. And then people have been saying, like, this this guy right here, Envy dimed you out. There is nothing to dime me out on. DJ Envy has nothing to dime me out about, and I don't have nothing to say bad about him. So you guys need to spin up these uh, fake scenarios that don't exist because... This is it, mad because Envy is better than Flex. Flex, man, you a fat little puto, a little ass country, ass house. Knock it off, puto. <laughs> you see the work. Knock it off. Pay your rent, Puto, because you don't want your house. Flex don't even know the house. You, you, but you, they you, don't know Flex, Flex was behind two months on his rent. They don't know that. Bro, <laughs> you could tell the guy's such a hater, because think about it. <laughs> Envy DJ, he's a DJ. He's still a DJ, fucking dropping a fucking bomb in his corny-ass show. And Envy has... You dropped of, the bomb in, nigga ass, man. And then you play the nigga music, nigga. Get the fuck out of here. Go back to the mega, you he's fucking Puto. Nor. He actually took it to the next level, and this guy still... Drop a bomb. Drop a bomb. Dude, 
You've been doing, saying the same shit since fucking. Yeah, like, y'all niggas believe. Like, wait, I'm gonna talk to you. Y'all believe Rick Ross, nigga? What well, was in jail? Rick Ross was a correctional officer. He was a CEO himself. That nigga ain't no real rapper. Yeah, support that bitch ass nigga, Rick Ross, mama don't worry or anything. Uh, not get the fuck off with that shit. You a correctional officer, nigga. You should work in the jail, man. You gave me my commentary, my first bag of fucking <laughs> Doritos. You gave it to me, Rick Ross. See? You don't remember the one. It's okay, but people don't understand that, right? See, what was Rick Ross when we were locked up, right? We used to get the Source magazine in prison, right? From Joe, remember Joe? My boy Joe. Joe, I'll give it up to you, man. Gorilla Manzu, puto. You're the best, Joe. But they don't talk about the Rick Ross shit. Rick Ross was a correctional officer. Became a rapper. Yo, my nigga, you, you write me a fucking verse? I'm gonna blow, puto. You understand? Anybody could be a rapper. Caesar's gonna be a rapper now. We're gonna sing about his story. Let him know, Caesar. Give him a verse right now. At this point, that's all I need, right? I already caught the case. Now just die, drop, a, drop a song or not. Drop a song. Oh, see, man, let's break him in the head. Man. Let's make a dumbo with the alpha. That's what they need. That's it. We, let's show them. You're all tough. You're going to do all this, my nigga. You ain't doing shit, man. Nobody tough here because everybody's watching, you heard? You're all tough. You're all tough gangsters, right? You said, you're so fucking tough. According to, uh, I think it's 10 times they're saying that. <laughs> they're so tough, right? Yeah, little fucking virginies. Now get the fuck off. I'm going to show you a clown put this. Come see me. I'm here. I'm, I'm, I'm home, man. I have no problem. They're tuning in. Mm -hmm. They listen to Tony. Tony and Baloney, man. You listen to a nigga that beat women. That nigga disrespect women. He beats them up. He gives them black eyes. But my girl beats me up. I take it like a man. She hit me with a cell phone yesterday. You think I'll give a fuck? King Jew, the that shit? It's already coming, King Jew. Don't worry about it. The movie's not going to come out after. I no, no, no. We're not going to show the movie. We want a hundred million. You heard? Well, no, no, Caesar. You know, yeah, Caesar. Caesar made off. Coming out soon. Caesar made off. Eighty million, right, Caesar? <laughs> uh, I think a hundred, right? It's a hundred eighty. No, no, no. You're on a hundred. I don't know. You passed the eighty already. Uh, I don't know what number Tony made up this week. You know, every week is something else. <laughs> nigga, believe what you want, nigga. It's called investments. When you invest in Bitcoin, shit goes back. Shit happens, nigga. Shit hits the fan. Knock it the fuck off. Y'all ran with the man, y'all keep running with Tony. At the end of the day, Caesar, let him know. You'll be fine, right? This is what it is, bro. We're hustlers, right? Oh, that's what we got to do. We got to man. We hustle, man. That's it. And what is it? Three sides or four sides to a story, right? Mm -hmm. That's it, man. Niggas, uh, niggas believe that fake news shit. How much envy lost? Keep it a G. Envy, <laughs> listen, man. Leave envy out of here, man. Leave envy out of this shit, man. Leave MV out of here, but MV hasn't lost anything. MV's a partner in a property that's worth more than what he invested in. He hasn't lost anything. His collateral is secure, and everybody's saying different things. And you know, but again, I don't want to talk about MV. You know, it, it is what it is. Watch the outcome. Get the popcorn. You heard? Get the cup. Con caramelito. Get that little popcorn with that little caramel. Huh? Uh -huh. Get yourself that popcorn with that little chocolate. Caesar, what you like on your popcorn? Caesar, let them know. You like twins yeah. or you like Snickers? You know what I do when I go to the movies? My popcorn, I actually get peanut butter, uh, peanut M&Ms. No, and you then know I, what I do? I put fucking Twix in my shit. A little bit of Snickers, though. I love the Snickers. Is it, uh, I, I don't like Snickers. I, I'm a white chocolate kind of guy. Oof. You like the Blancas? Yeah, I like, I, I, I'm a white chocolate kind of right, guy. You like I, American pussy? Let them know, Caesar. Eh? America. Be great I, again, I, puto. I and you know what? Trump's going to win. Trump's going to be my, my bunky, they said. Trump, you going to be my bunky, puto? <laughs> Yeah, make America great. He's gonna part in all of us. You yeah. see, you don't work. He, he's definitely up on the polls. You know, I, I hope he definitely wins. But that guy, that guy's cat, catching more cases than John Gotti every week. But then they, they don't show when he wins his cases because, right? They, they don't want to show the positive. They only show the negative. It's all right. I think Trump is gonna win season, man. That nigga ain't gonna get like that. He gonna be the first president in jail, my nigga. Y'all don't know the future, right? Back in the day, there was no president behind bars. This is gonna be the first president in jail. You understand? That nigga gonna run the country in a camp with Caesar, right, Caesar? I hope so. You know, he'll, he's gonna be your bunkie, he'll part, Caesar. Pardon me. He'll, 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 he'll pardon me, bro. You know, well, you know, it's funny when I was in when I was locked up last time. The first book that I read about real estate was uh, Trump: The Art of the Deal. That, that's what inspired me to get into uh, to get into real estate. 
And I, I love that there's a lot of uh, tr Trump supporters here. Look, 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 I got, I got the, the number one Trump supporter. Back to South, man. Oh. <laughs> Let him know, Puta. You don't see the work. You see that shit, man. Right. We like up the whole fucking city. You see it. Listen, man, you don't order a shirt, man. You're going to order Tony shirt, man. You're full of fucking bologna and cheese. It's all right. I got Tony shirt soon with his little manicures and his little nails. We got him. We got him, Putos. Talk that shit, you heard? Yeah. And then we somebody... got more people on this live than anybody. Lucio's 92K. That is the dumbest shit in the world, you say. <laughs> Let him yeah. know, Caesar. Let him know, man. That is the dumbest shit in the world. There was a contractor involved in that case. The contractor took all the money. Lucci was just a sub... Uh, whatever. We don't even got to talk about that, but you guys are a bunch of retards. You keep on paying attention to the wrong narrative, but again, thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, I suggest people become men, right, and grown-ups and stop bringing kids into something that they shouldn't. They shouldn't. Yeah, like, you Yo, my nigga, you got beef with me and Caesar? Have with me and Caesar. This is just all, all our kids. Because you know what? Well, my, my kids are, well, Caesar, my kids are tougher than now. My kids are tougher than me. Careful. Oh, they don't, they don't know that the, kids are gangsters. They don't know. They don't, they don't, they don't know what they're acting. Kids, my nigga. You, you ain't fucking with my kids. My kids are <laughs> brat. But at the end of the day, my nigga, leave the kids out of it, bro. So you're still tuning in. Everybody. That's it, man. Uh, whatever you're still tuning in and i'm still rich. Blind, little shot. at the end of the day we're gonna show the teachers for a thousand dollars next week but we're gonna wait till it blows up because y'all keep talking all that shit but at the end of the day we I love you we you know, uh with uh a trap landlord hoodie and we should donate the proceeds to uh the victims of domestic abuse yes um, yeah. yeah so we're women that get beat up but like niggas named tony the closer because at the end of the day man yeah that guy's an abuser man you see his rap sheet? Y'all talk all that shit about us. Y'all gonna believe a guy that beat women? Bro. He talks to y'all like it's trash. He talks to y'all like but, trash. I'm follow Tony right now. And the next one I want you to unfollow is uh, Caesar and Jenny Page. Because that bitch is a troll. She's talking about all oh, my money is yeah. drug money. Bitch, right. my money ain't drug money. Bro, I've been paying my taxes all my We're life. following you. That's it. Anybody, we are following you. We are yeah, yeah. following you. Talk that negative shit, my nigga. Go, go, go say that I sell drugs. Nigga, y'all can't find nothing on me, bro. I'm a real nigga. I work hard for my yeah. money. I don't do none of that scam shit or none of that shit, man. I'm a real nigga, bro. Now get the fuck off. I got a family. I got kids. I want to be free, put those you. Caesar, breathe the breath. Take a breath for me. Spoke and directly about the credit dudes. You know how much shit the credit dude has talked about me? Oh, but they don't talk about the credit dude, how he went to jail. All right, let's talk about, that. You, let's talk about, talk about, about Jose I Rodriguez. You. You piece He's of a scam, I, I bro. Man, they got a big... December of last year, I put three posts and he cries like a baby because he's a bitch. That, okay, just he said, but, 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 but Caesar, let's be honest. Why Jose Rodriguez went to jail? People don't know he got court martial. People don't know no, he, I don't, he fucked it. Jose Rodriguez is driving around a Rolls Royce lives in a mansion, but he's a disabled veteran, and he's getting money from the government. He doesn't pay taxes on his <laughs> house. And then smoke on. That I'm a fraud? Bro, you're defrauding the government. You're flying around in private planes, and you're, you're getting a check for disability, and you're not paying your, the taxes. What the fuck? I'm Nobody not, sees that. Talk about that PPP I'm, loans. I'm not, I'm not taking money from taxpayers. I actually pay my taxes. I pay too mm -hmm. much taxes. But I'll talk about hotels. Rodriguez, he went to jail for like six months, a year. You know what Jose Rodriguez did? My nigga, that nigga's so crazy. Don't believe these niggas on Instagram. Bro, they talk all that shit now, but now she's in charge. He's fine. We're going to talk about it. Yeah. Everybody want to talk the truth. We're going to be the truthful yeah. niggas. Because at the end of the day, y'all going to believe the fuck Everybody what you say. Yeah, none of y'all niggas are true like us. And, they, and, they, and they're, not, they're, not, they're not 100 percent about it, right? You want to point the finger at the next man, but you know, it is what it is. Again, uh, Thanks, everybody, for tuning in. See you guys soon. I'm All right, wait, have... wait, wait, wait. You see the work soon. We're going to see the work at the hand. I'm going to go to Brazil. I'm going to see the work everywhere. I'm going to show you the work all over the country. I'm going to have Airbnbs everywhere where my harm earned money, putos. You see the work. Let them know, Cesar. Yeah, you see Rod the work, too. Or... No work. Before Jose Rodriguez met me, he was in foreclosure. They didn't even own a house. There are multiple videos, text messages. This guy saying, Caesar, you're my, like my dad. Caesar, you're like my dad. I love you. I love Envy. That guy betrayed all of us. The minute that he saw he couldn't profit from us anymore, and we weren't pushing him. You know what, him. Caesar? I'm going to dress like because I'm a little drunk. Buka, suck a dick. Nick the Grinch, suck a dick. Y'all niggas talk all that shit, but... No, 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 no. Don't start talking about people. We're not doing all that. There's no need reason. No, but they were my...
friends. I took you everywhere. I took you all and over the country. Like, I was your real friend, man. Bro. And then you're going to throw me under the bus? Like, what the fuck? The thing is friends. You'll be lucky how many friends you really have. Well, that it makes no sense. That was right. That said, before he died, he had two friends. Hold on. Anybody that does business with God Credit, Jose the Credit Jew, be very scared. Jose the Credit Jew has your personal information. If he's mad at you, he is going to post your information online and he is going to talk about you. Uh, two weeks ago, he posted my personal credit report, went on Tony the Closer's page, went on, uh, posted Jennifer's closing, so her credit report with Tony the Closer. Anybody that the, ever did business with Jose the Credit Jew got credit. Credit clean safe solutions, credit bullshit, the credit kid, the credit wife, the credit barber. The credit, credit, credit puta, because that bitch gets credit for being a puta. Because he has a puta credit. information, and when that guy, that guy is not right in the head, and when he's mad at you, he will leak your personal information and put it online. He did it to me, he did it to my wife, and he's done it to other people. Oh, he tried to do it to me. That has done business with that man be very scared who's that nigga wait wait let's block this you go to jail yeah i'll see you soon puto you'll be my buggy i'm gonna fuck you in the butt with no masalina again everybody fuck god credit fuck jose the credit do do fuck not do Tony Bologna, make sure for christina not to release your personal information because that guy will do it and i'm that's just a warning it's not because i'm not talking to him he broke the code, code of ethics if you give your a company your personal information they should not release it that shit is crazy and everybody's laughing about it, but bro, what the hell's going on? Yeah, I for you. Like that, that shit makes no sense. And all the people that I recommended to him, all the people that went to the seminar to use them, I apologize to you that me and DJ Envy did not do our, our homework and didn't know that guy was a psycho. I apologize to everybody that I ever recommended to God credit, my, my friends, anybody that I recommended to Jose Rodriguez and his company and his fucking God credit uh bozos i apologize to you and be very scared that your personal information does not get leaked or sold to somebody else because that guy has no ethics when it comes to business he did it to me which he did it to me and he's a real i was his father i was his father figure and then your dad's still alive go talk to that guy Yo, don't buy don't no, see the man you talked about you a crackhead my nigga your dad didn't give a fuck about yeah. you He's throwing you for a fucking piece of rock and then get on the beach. Let's not be negative. Everybody have a great Friday. Everybody enjoy your... How about drink for us, Puto? Yeah. I see you in the strip no. club. Yep. Meet me at T.E. Channel's Club because we're going back to Patterson. You say, I can't go there. I'll be there. I'm there no. every weekend, Puto. You need to see the work. Hey, I was looking at my properties and, and running around. Like, we're in Patterson every day. Ain't nobody running. Like, we outside. Like, ain't nobody going nowhere. Like, I'm, I can't go nowhere. I'm stuck in my house. She's so got a break. Bracelet, my nigga. That bracelet talks Spanish, English, Brazilian. That shit got a like hundred languages. Bro, that, let them know. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That bracelet. Let them know about it's it's pretty it's easier with a bracelet. To me today. Charge a bracelet. Charge a bracelet. Charge a bracelet. 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 That's it. That bracelet talk back, you heard? Yeah. Tell him, tell him. He said, yo, you close to the airport. Yeah. <laughs> they thought Caesar was running. Close to an airport. I can't, uh, I can't cross state lines. Uh, it's definitely a new way of living. So, all right, man. But we've been through this. We're strong, man. Listen, man. Real niggas. I'll get it uh, done. At the end of the day, happy birthday, Pooh right. Whose birthday is today? Hi, everybody. We'll take you out. Friday. All right. See you. Talk to you later. Love you, right. brother.